Welcome to the video guys. Today I'm going to show you my grasslands village that I refurbished out of a ruin. Now this village doesn't have anything super special in my eyes other than the stuff that was already here. There's three main reasons that I really did this. One of the reasons is that it has this dirt road and dirt pathways going to each building. As you can see, you cannot create these in the game. The second reason is that it has objects that I cannot place. It has objects that I do not have unlocked, like the mailboxes, like the trash cans, some barrels. And the third reason, since my grassland village is my main hub where I keep all my gear, it's very important to me to have it close to my other villages. If you look at this map, you can see that my desert village on the sea is right there. And also my shore village is right here as well. It's very easy and fast to swim here with my three wave break charms to access all my items. Now, I think this village is okay. I think it looks fine, but I probably am gonna tear everything down eventually and redo it my way from the ground up and try to keep as many of these special objects as I can. The only structure that I did not refurbish to its original state is a structure here that houses all of my equipment and machinery. Now, this structure did exist already with these pillars, but it was about one fourth of the size that it is. All I did was expand it and make it bigger so it could fit all of the machines in there. But like I said, besides that, all the other buildings are restored to their original dimensions. I did change some walls into windows. As you guys know, if you've seen my other videos, you will know that I do like windows over walls and I put windows everywhere I can on every single building as much as I can. I also added these lights that go through along the roads here. I thought they were just a cool little effect. They don't really light too much up um, for the cost of these and the materials needed to use them. I don't think they're really worth it for actual lighting, but I think they look okay. Another thing that you may have noticed if you watch my other videos is that this is my fish village. So I took all 51 of my legendary fish. Yes, 51, including all 15 of the legendary species and I hung them up along the inside of my base wall. I did that because I just didn't know where else to put them. I planned on putting them inside of one of my desert village buildings, but once I saw how big they were, I realized there's no way those are fitting in there. It was kind of a spur of the moment thing, but I think it looks pretty cool and I don't know where else I would put them. I may have used some for my shore village just for decorations in a couple of spots, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I just wanted to make sure that I had footage of this village before I tore it down eventually and built something else here instead. Let me know in the comments if you guys think I should rip this whole village down and build from scratch and do it my way, or if I should leave it how it is as a restored original village. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.